Kraken hosting the Stars, game number six of round number two. And the Stars are minus 165 on the money line. The Kraken are plus 140. The over-under is six goals. The Stars laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 158, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win this game by two. And the Kraken getting a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 190, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one. You would win. Now head to head, the home team is five and five. The stars are six and four against the Kraken in their ten meetings. The favorite is on a two-game winning streak. The favorite is six and four on the money line. The underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is six and four. There have been four one-goal games in their last ten meetings. There really haven't been any one-goal games in their last uh, five games. The last one was five games ago. The over has hit in their last eight games. The over is eight and two. And the over six is seven, two, and one. The last game that they played, which was game number four. No, oh, forgive me. Uh, game number five. The Stars won five to two. And game four, the Stars won six to three. And game three, the Kraken won seven to two. Then the Stars won four to two. And then the Kraken won five to four in overtime in Dallas. I think the Stars have figured out how to beat the Kraken, and it was a nice run while it lasted, but it's probably going to end tonight for the Kraken. I'm going to take the Stars with the money line. I'm going to take the Stars laying the goals, and I'm going to go over. I would be elated if we actually get a Game 7 in this series, but I think uh, the Stars are going to move on. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.